see we've got a target next to a good target just here which is why we're getting some funny numbers there, don't even have to dig. Another two dollars. Okay, here's a good example on my settings. I reckon I've got a, a 50 cent coin underneath a dollar here. I'm getting 17.18, but I'm getting a little high tone coming in. Just every now and again. Let's have a look. Feel it just under the grass. Part of a bottle cap. Surely that's not what was given off a signal. Aha. Uh -huh. Well, can't be right every time. Got another signal. Feel it there. There are you. There it is. Another two dollars. Awesome. Okay, just dug a two dollar about five seconds ago. Got another one. So I've got a couple of coins within a meter or so of each other. So I'm going to grid this area, show you sort of about the sweep speed I use with the Equinox when I'm gold coin hunting. I move fairly fast. You don't want to go crazy. We can hear I've got uh, a lot of the trash targets muted out. Oh. Here we go. Let's have a look at this one. A little bit deeper than the others. Fair bit deeper because the pinpoint is not getting it. Oh, 
because I'm at a sports field. I'm not going to dig it. Because I don't like to make a mess. If I can't get it with the pinpointer, it stays. Shame because I'm sure that's a coin. One that's probably a bit deep. Hmm. Pretty sure that's going to be a one cent piece. And you can see I'm getting along at a fair pace, making sure. Ooh. Interesting. Now that's possibly a two cent coin, but it sounds shallow. Let's have a look. Oh. A bit too shallow for a two cent. something in there. Hmm. I think she might be a two cent. Definitely a coin. Yep, two cent. Surprisingly shallow. Shouldn't have pushed stop. Another goldie here, I'm sure. Nice and shallow. Let's have a look. Feel it. Ah, another dollar. Lovely. Let's see if there's anything else here. And what I'm doing, because I like the grid areas, the groundskeepers have been nice enough to. Ooh, a funny signal. She's jumping around a fair bit. So I'm going to call that a bit of trash. She's all over the shop. And has a fairly wide pinpoint so I'm going to leave that more than likely a bit of can. But anyway, I'm using the lines that our ground keepers are done for us we just work each little square up and down that way you can't miss anything something deeper here. Leave that one. Very important when you're at sports fields not to dig. The last thing you want to do is get kicked out. Ruin it for other guys that might want to come and work here.
there's our one scent again you can see I've heard that before and I'm hearing it again because I'm overlapping each little row that I do Take me maybe five minutes and I've covered two meter wide rows of probably 20 meters so you can see getting along at this pace you're not going to miss much but you're still going to cover loads of ground I'll switch you off now and bring you back when I've got something to show you Every time I push the stop button, another coin here, fairly solid, nice tight pinpoint. Let's get in and have a look. There it is, didn't even have to dig. Nice new dollar. I'll have that. Keep going. I don't know if you can hear it on the video guys, but the downside about this particular sports field, there's something at the clubhouse making this awful high-pitched beeping noise. Cockatoos in the background sort of make up for it though. Oh, that's a nice whippy one. That'd be another coin. Have a look. Tripod will stand up. Here he is. Oh, another dollar. Strange, I seem to find more two dollars at this place, but uh, today I'm getting about 50 50. Keep moving. Almost done. Whoa! That's why she was so whippy. Another coin there. That's why you always check where you've been digging, guys. Because if you don't check, you can walk right away from that. Felt him there. Where did he go? Oh, there he is again. Not even buried another dollar. Starting to turn into a good hunt. Shush. Keep going. Just to be out at my line. Oh, there we go, another one. Let's get him out and have a look. the dollar. Very strange. 
It's not going to leave him there, though. So you can really see if you're being nice and thorough, gridding areas. Oh. I think there's a much deeper dollar there, but I'll leave that one because I don't want to dig. But you can see how being thorough, you cannot miss. Gridding areas, you cannot miss. If I'd walked in random straight line through this area, probably wouldn't have got many of those coins, if any. See how many more we can pull out. Probably got one more row after this one. We'll move squares. And then I'll turn you off. And if I get anything interesting along the way, I'll bring you all back. Come on, give me one more coin before I turn you off. And voila. Nice, solid 1920. Confident of a coin again. And I've dropped, dropped me coin probe. See if I can get this one without the probe. Probably can't. Pause you and I'll get me coin probe. Two seconds. All right, back again. Round two. Coin probe, oh geez, right next to it. Nice shiny two dollars. Awesome. I'll leave you there for now. I'll see what else I can find. Got another coin. This one's given us a couple of funky numbers. Pretty confident it's coin still. Have a look. Where are you? Here it is. Ah, sitting right on its edge. Two dollar coin. That's why it was giving us uh, some funky sort of numbers. Okay, here's a good example for you all. Um, in the previous video you could see uh, the dollar coins, particularly when we pinpoint them, give a really short, sharp uh, pinpointing noise, particularly especially if we go over them slow. And I got here classic gold coin tone. And a couple of ways and I'll show you that I think this is a can. One of them, so I can hear it a fair way off the ground, but when I come to pinpoint it and I go over it nice and slow, When I go nice and slow, it's quite a long pinpoint area. So I can be pretty confident that one's a can. Here we go. This one I'm sure is a coin. Listen to the pinpoint. When we go slow, pinpoints very narrow band. See if we can find it and prove the point. There he is, I can feel it. Been in there a while. And 
sure enough, grab the old dollar coin. Definitely been there for a while. So yeah, when you you coin hunting, she gives you a big long pinpoint signal when you go over it slow. Just keep on walking. More than likely going to be a can. Another coin. 2021. Stand up. Yep, there it is. Another two dollars. It's turning into a very good hunt. Another one. Pretty sure that's a coin again. Two dollars. Awesome. Another coin. Let's have a look. Oh, lost me probe again. Hang on. All right, I've got me probe. Gotcha. Another dollar. Been there for a while too. So here we go guys, result of the uh, hunt this morning. Where are we? We've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight dollars and ones. Two, four, six, eight, ten, twelve, fourteen, sixteen in twos, a two cent coin. And a little pendant. It's not bad for an hour. Uh, shame I got cut short. Um, if you guys turning up for footy training, have a good one. <laughs>